you guys heard the finger story? No. Um, Dave was hitting on a girl. I walked up to wing him, and he wasn't doing so hot. Mm. And the second I walked up, so walk up like near me, start to talk. <laughs> oh, this story. No, I do remember this story now. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So then later on, we're walking through a small <laughs> corridor that so she was walking towards. She didn't see me because it was crowded. <laughs> <laughs> remember me? <laughs> and then there's a wall right here. So I went like that, and she stayed, stayed right there, and I said, come here. And then we were like this. And we were talking about dogs and cats. <laughs> That was the fucking conversation. But we were this close, and her boobs were like pressed up against me, and we were actually talking this close. Mm. And were you touching and her as you guys were t talking? Yeah, I was touching her like this and like this, but that was really it. Because we're this mm. close, like you don't need to do a whole lot if you're this close. Mm. You don't really need to do much, right? You're just here and you're talking, and it's just a matter of time. Whenever I end up in a situation like that where I'm really close to a guy, um, I can't help but get turned on. If, and if I'm willing to let myself get that close to, to a guy, then I'm at least halfway attracted to him. And it's like, it like turns on like a sexuality inside me. Mm -hmm. So I don't think I would ever do the, <laughs> this move, right. <laughs> but she started it. Right. And yeah, I got her back pretty good. I was proud of myself for that one. <laughs> Fucking bitch, kissing with these, I'll give her feedback a lot harder. <laughs>